Hello and welcome to another edition of Tom's Toolbox. I'm your host, Tom Clark, and today we're going to patch this pipe using Defense Block Quick Patch from DevCon. Now, before we start, I want to mention that we should always wear the proper PPE for whatever job that we're doing. For today, I'm not only going to put on my protective glasses, but I've also got on some gloves as well. And make sure whatever the job calls for, you're wearing uh, the right PPE because safety is always priority number one. All right, let's get started. Now, here's the deal. This pipe that's in front of me, okay, it's got a hole in it, likely caused by the abrasion from coal or aggregate materials. So I got to patch this, okay? Now, what you want to do first, you want to clean this hole right here with like a cleaner or degreaser. Get all the corrosion, any contaminants off the surface. That's step number one. Next, I got the wheel here. And what I would want to do I'm going to go around the outside of that and sort of clean off everything, make it nice and smooth. It's almost like you're painting the same way. You know, you sand before you paint. Well, I'm going to grind before I patch. Now, good surface contact. We're ready to go. I've got a hardener and I've got a resin here. Now, together, combined, it's going to be a two-tone color that I'm going to mix this product, okay? DevCon quick patch. It's got a four minute working time, so the product's got to be mixed quickly and ready to move on to the part that you're repairing, okay? So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take some hardener first, all right? Here's my hardener. Okay, now I'm going to get equal parts of the resin, and it's important that we do this. You want to make sure that you get equal amounts, because you, you have to do a one-to-one -one on this. Now, Here's what's cool. This comes with your own applicator right here. This is what I call the DevCon spatula. And you want to mix it with this all together. Now, the whole deal about this, you ever been to like, um, I don't know, the East Coast somewhere? And you see they have the fudge shops? Now here's what's interesting about this, is this is exactly how they mix fudge with the same type of spatula. You want to make sure that this turns a solid gray. No streaks of the white or the lighter gray from the resin and nothing from the black. You can see we're getting close. I'm feeling really confident about this. All right, I'm good right there. So now this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna save the spatula right there and this is the reason why. I'm gonna put all of this on top of this plastic bag, okay? I'm gonna scoop it out and then I'm gonna apply it onto the pipe, into the hole, making sure that I've covered the entire surface and attained good contact of the epoxy with the metal surface. Okay, I'm gonna show you this. I'm taking my hand out. Now look, there it is on the pipe. That's a real nice patch right there, but I'm also gonna show this to the camera here. Look up underneath here. You can see it coming through. All right, now that's what I want. I wanna make sure that my hole is completely covered. And just to make sure, I'm gonna put my hand in there and I wanna make sure it's all in there really good because that stuff could shoot it out. You wanna make sure it's covered, it's real nice. I'm feeling extremely confident right now. Now within 30 minutes, DevCon Quick Patch is fully cured and your pipe is ready for service. The patch is nice and smooth. Now this is great for any industry that uses abrasive materials like coal, sand, aggregate materials, and minerals. And just to let you know, here's what the finished piece looks like right here. Look at that. Hard as a rock, ready to go. Well, that's gonna do it for this edition of Tom's Toolbox. Couldn't have gotten any easier, honestly. Hey, look for other videos as well with me, Tom Clark, as your host. The website, mihowto.com. Thanks so much for watching.